Hey everybody, we are back, recording, ready to go, free to play please. We've added a few teams to the Hall of Fame recently, that's kind of exciting for me. We've now had six 10-win teams since the patch came out. Look, we were getting like six per run. Obviously that's impossible, but just forgive me, my trespasses, uh, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Be the wavy bones. Something you probably don't want, unless they're the bones in your hand when you're saying goodbye. Uh, so it's like, I think we've fallen back a little bit, obviously, but we have been trending upwards since we realized how bad we were. <laughs> I think we've gotten a little bit better since then, since we realized how bad we were. I'm going to do something weird here. I like getting a second cricket that pops out for now. I'm going to sack one mosquito damage to add a, uh, a fish to the team. This gives us very wide coverage for getting a, a triplicate animal. And thus getting up to uh, a tier 3 unit on turn 3, which is nice. Now we got animals we've never seen before, so that's not ideal. But on a roll, we should be... Doing a little bit better. Um, I'm going to roll again. It had to happen at some point. I'm going to roll again. This is messed up. I think you can you can run a peacock irrespective now. Even, even just to have a 2-5. Give me a 2-5 peacock with potential upside over a 3-5 uh, elephant that we want to die anyway. So, like, I knew we were, based on the shops, I wasn't feeling too confident there. But we can at least do this. We can say goodbye to you. We can say hello to you. We can say goodbye to you. Maybe a bit of a weird one here, but if you'll allow me, I think you could throw a flamingo into the mix. I don't really love any of the other animals involved here, but to get a stat increase... Seems kind of nice. The Flamingo's not even making a trade. This is the same person. God, this would be sweet. Just, yes! <laughs> you thought you had me. You never even had your car. Okay. Sell me. Buy me. The fish has melon. It's more likely to stick around than a peacock right now. So let's... Kill the flamingo in front of the ox, but also buffing the fish. Then let's add another fish to this situation. Let's freeze a, a flamingo. I know you would be like, why would you do that? Well, hold on. I think we actually like this. But we want to... Eh, no, this is fine. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. Um, I think the flamingo gives us a benefit in battle, even without being buffed. It, perhaps preferentially without being buffed. Um... And then if we pill it, it makes our ox better forever. So it's not the most cost-effective way to do things, but it, it seems like it's doing some work for us so far. Roll me. Don't see a pill. Would I level a peacock here? I would invest in a peacock before I invest in this 4-5 cricket. So I, I accept this. I think we made some modest improvements there. That's big. I love when an enemy team has one good unit and then you just kill it with melon armor. It happens to me all the time too. So you are not alone. You gotta go. I do love a big hippo, but I'm really like, I'm rooster pilled right now. And I stand by that. I stand by the rooster pill. I will continue to just feed you pears for now. If we ever get you leveled, this is going to be something we're very thankful for. And the next pill is going to be very good for us, I think. Hold on, I'm cracked. Many people are saying I'm the best that's ever played this game. Can you believe this? Nobody said that. It's true. But if they said it, pill me. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that because now we move you up. We move you here, we pill you. We still get rid of a peacock before we get rid of anything else, but the fish and the ox maybe are not that far behind. Um, a penguin doesn't do it for us yet. We, we don't have the right squaddle composition. It's a very weird looking team, but I think our equipment will allow us to hit above our weight class right now. What the heck, my melons? My melon armors? That's painful. 
Oh, never mind. We win. I respect the team. I run that team myself many times. Feed me. Pill is so important, though. You, I think we could probably freeze a monkey and start to think about, like, late-game scaling. With, I'm going to freeze you without a doubt. <sighs> okay, fine. I'm going to hit the fish just because it buffs everything. Freeze me. Okay, next steps. Pill the turtle in front of the rooster. Play the cow. Feed the milk to the rooster. Hold on. Am I living with this? Am I living for this? Am I doing okay? I think I'm doing okay. I think I'm coming out of my cage and I'm feeling just fine. I hope you were writing that down because I surely don't remember it. You need the melon armor much more than the ox needs a plus two. You're in. You're out. You get fed. Until you're a level three, I think we like the idea of you getting scaled by a uh, monkey. It's an easy way to get you some HP that would otherwise, or some, some everything that would otherwise be impossible. I think our fish or our peacock is not long for this world. The beautiful thing about selling a fish is that 8-9 melon armor probably beats a 6-9 peacock with meat right now. That's nasty. That's a nasty team right there. But... We get so much more gold from the fish that we get more more juice to play around with. You do have melon armor. You're not you're never scaling though. Start here. I'm gonna say sell me. I'm gonna get a little crazy, okay? Feed me, feed me. This is a very strong unit now. We are gonna look for our level three, a level two cow, I should say. Didn't get it. I'm fairly confident in this team. Which means I would not mind basically just adding a snail just to have one. The only thing that sucks is that our rooster is level 1. If it gets to level 2, this unit is like 10 times better. Don't skunk me. I invented the skunk, okay? Peacock still got the job done. I'm feeling slightly vindicated. That's 9? I guess we're, we won pretty early. You gotta go. Man, this team, like, did not draw at all, huh? I thought about a stake, but... I thought about a snake, man. I think you could maybe make this work. I think it's it's worth a shot. I would rather feed you two pairs. I don't, I don't really care if our ox goes up a level. This is basically, like, our live or die round. If we lose this, we can still win by getting a level two rooster and reworking its position. But, like... I think we're going to win. I don't think we even needed to sweat it now that I look at it. Wow, in fact, they didn't even kill one unit. Little surprised, but you know what it goes to show you? The power of an ox, man. Like, if you get an ox, you're kind of a scumbag. Not me, on the other hand. I'm a professional gamer, so I have, like, my reputation to maintain. So, like, me buying an ox, the only reason I'm buying an ox is because I need to get an ox to compete with you guys who are taking oxes. But, like, if you guys aren't filming yourselves playing this game, I don't understand why you're rolling oxes. Like, act like you've been there. I'm just joking, okay? I'm just jazzed because we won a game. Uh, good. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. We, we got good... Oh, we got four spaces, too. The mosquito is actually, like, more likely to stick right now. So take some honey. Um... We got wide coverage, you know? We got four different animals. Holy cow, a 6'4 ant. But for what purpose? For what purpose? Mustard pocket. We like the level. I'll take a honey badger. I'll, I'll be the change I never want to see in the world. I think you got to make a decision here. Um, and I don't think the decision is leveling a fish. And that's just sincerity from me. Sincerity? I think the decision is adding a flamingo, which is probably functionally pretty similar to a fish, but also gives us the chance for later scaling and easier pivots. Okay. I mean, a horse is a nice thing to have against uh, enemy rats, but I don't think that rat was necessarily that well thought out. No offense. No, I've been there very recently, in fact. Uh, and I don't mean on vacation. Hit me. We got to get rid of this horse cricket dependency soon. Nah, 
I, I saw, so, you know what? So you're basically a 1 2 and then a 3 1. Okay, you know what? I'm going sickle mode. It's very strange, don't get me wrong, but we'll for a turn we'll have a 4 9 crab. Stats aren't that crazy, but one meat takes it up to a 9 9. I would be happy to to call a 9 9 my friend for quite some time. I can't believe it worked. We also need honey for our badger. That's that's going to turn a lot of losses into into draws. Nothing here appeals to me. Starting to feel a little offended. Did I did I be honest? Did I roll over meat or honey? It seems likely, <laughs> given that those are like two of the only things available right now. Um, I could add a peacock, but. I would rather just throw one more mosquito in here for the time being. We're still looking for meat. We see it. This seems like a safe bet right now. And the horse has got to go. This squad right now was built for drawing. This is not an incredible squad. Especially now that I see that 12-11 dog. So much for drawing, but that's okay. We, we, we stalled out in our last shop. This is, this is where the snails are going to pop. You're going to hit them with a little yaw. And a little ya. Yeah. And a little ya. Yeah. You know what? I'm a fool. <laughs> I'm gonna try something that ain't ever been done before. First, we gotta win this round. I don't know if that's gonna happen. I think there's a chance, man. There's no shot. <laughs> if we got through that hippo and the, then the unit behind it, maybe. Okay, but like, I'm... I know you're going to laugh at me, okay? But I think the world is ready for Big Snail. And if we lose this round, we'll certainly be happy to have you around, my good friend. I was so excited to get a penguin out there for plus one, plus one across two animals. Like, that's just a sad story. I'm kind of embarrassed with myself. Never mind, I'm one of the best to ever play the game. There we go, that's four wins. Keep building. Keep, bu keep that frozen. Build up your mosquito. Continue to build up your mosquito. Probably you would take a, a melon armor at some point. Freeze a pill when it shows up. You know what? Maybe we get a crab popping. I'm realizing now this is the face of a man who has realized he's not going to have enough gold to accomplish his ambitions. Level 2 turtle? Kind of a U-piece move, but you know what? Look at this. Somehow we're at 6 wins. Wait, 5 wins. This is a, the face of a man who realized he cannot count. Um, feed me? I guess we're not selling a crab. I can't sell a honey badger to get a turtle out here. Like, don't make me laugh. Guess what? Snail chili pepper. That's where we're at now. You thought you were safe? Think again. Level 3 mosquito incoming. Still a penguin that's only giving one ones, but one of these days... <laughs> oh, no, no, no. One of these days... Hold on. Today? Today? Today! This snail's gonna stay frozen forever, man. Level three. A tiger does not work here. Yes! Level two crab. It arrived! We all know in our hearts that the dragon is the right idea. So I'm gonna I'm gonna indulge that, okay? I don't really this is we're we're toasted here. Look at this double scaler. Honestly, like I feel have some self-respect. Monkey and penguin. What is this like you're you're still trying to get your first win? That's rude, but I don't apologize in this case. Everybody gets plus one plus one. Let's embrace that. Then I think we will also say goodbye. Even though you have a chili pepper and I appreciate what you've done for the squad. We need to scale wider and we need to scale better. I'll accept the loss of chocolate in order to get a little of this out there. 
Still freeze me, roll me. We got any tier ones? We don't have any tier ones. I don't mind losing honey in order to get some melon armor. So hopefully a pill shows up soon. If not, I still think this had some, it has some sensibility. Level two, huh? I'm not feeling too bad. I'm not feeling bad at all. That's seven wins. This squad should not be at seven, and yet here we are. I'm saying goodbye for now. Hopefully we just get an ambient melon. I would love to add it. I'd also love to go for a level two dragon, but on lethal, you know, your priorities sometimes change a little bit. Definitely don't want two honey badgers. I would say roll me. And we add another turtle to the team. <laughs> this team is not good enough still for round 12, but a couple more, you know, fluky wins. Not sure if that's gonna happen. Or is it a couple more fluky wins, a couple more good scales? Anything could happen, man. Okay, we got a tier one. That means we need to sell. We need to start getting another buy in here. We got to finish on a turtle, ideally. The power of the dragon. If you got to, you got to. Yikes. Um... No melon armor has me feeling definitely a lot worse about this team. It's a rough one. I told you we shouldn't have even made it this far. To get to eight wins on this team is kind of hilarious to me. Give me that double mosquito. Oh, what the heck? It's the mathematically optimal team, kind of? Let's be a sticky swimmer. It's be, you know, you get the joke, I'm sure. I don't know if this team... No, it de actually, it just stomped. I was going to say, I don't know if it beats pay to win, but it, it kind of stomped there. Let's add a third. This is a, a very interesting position, but I think the best thing we could do is add a unit that's about to level up. Then we get an early giraffe on level, and then the whole freaking house of cards comes down for our enemies, and we, we get a flawless game. Thank you. I think a kangaroo could do something. But first, I want to see if we get a giraffe. Two kangaroos? Have you lost your mind? How about a... How about a spider... Temporarily in front of a kangaroo. I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth. The chance for a kangaroo to get to level 2. That's a unit that scales itself in the throes of battle. Well, this is... Fair enough. Honestly, I pay respect to that. <laughs> it, it hurts, but I respect it. Why not? And I'll be honest, why not? I still think the kangaroo does best with two guaranteed triggers behind the spider. 10-10 mosquito? What the heck? Again, at what cost? I, and for what purpose? On what grounds? Camel, miss me. Mosquito, hit me. Honestly, salad me. Those two units are both likely to stick around. I think for now, we'd actually love for you to have some meat. I think you could do some more damage there. I'm not scared. I think my kangaroo is going to be better. Confirmed. Not interested. Now, would I add a giraffe here? I would add a giraffe at the expense of an otter. I would add a turtle at the expense of a spider for sure. I think I would do that immediately. Forget that garlic. I would add... I would add a lot of things. Oh, okay. Now you got me interested. So I think we can have a melon armored mosquito that makes our level two kangaroo have the best chance to pop. It's probably not going to pop every round. That's okay. Honestly, this person doesn't even know how lucky they just got, probably. Then, breast milk enthusiast. The sticky sailors. Great minds think alike. On the name, not on the palate cleanser. Okay, and then... We have our giraffe temporarily scale, our rooster. Then we think about what to do with this beaver. It gives 4 HP 
in death. So that seemed pretty good to me. I think you could maybe talk about throwing one of these in here for now. The giraffe is not... I don't, maybe the giraffe is sticking around at 3.8. Maybe the giraffe is sticking around. I think we do it like this because we want to make sure it buffs... I don't know what we want. I mean, you know what? We, I, I've got an idea, but it's not for this turn. It's for next turn. We could put the rooster in front of the kangaroo, and then that will get the buffs. Good shooting. Good shooting, dolphin. I feel like this team has a chance. Roof? Excuse me, Roof? Is that Apollo? Are you playing right now? More scalers. One more scaler. All... It's only round eight. I'm not buying an apple. I would much rather roll. That's a big roll. That's an interesting roll. I don't think it's worth it necessarily. But then I'm thinking, okay, I think you can do this now. So that kangaroo and rooster both get the buffs. It does screw over your mosquito a little bit, but your mosquito's got melon armor. It shouldn't be sweating it. By the way, your turkey's dead. Oops, we won. Such a sore winner. I love it. Feed me, feed me. Now we got to rework the game plan yet again. You can come back to the front. If I'm being real, I think you could sack a dolphin, run a mosquito. Roll me, freeze me, freeze me. We, we do want as much buffing power as possible. This team is kind of weak, but you can't ignore... That it's also still pretty early. And not to mention, our kangaroo is never actually coming out as like a 9-8. Like it's always gonna, it's gonna be a bit more of a heavy hitter. So what needs the buff? The rooster, always. If we can get that rooster to level 3, that's like a very, it has a buoyant impact on our chances of success overall. I don't really think it's, uh, the best investment here to to do uh, a, a level three giraffe. Personally, I do think a skunk could work, but I I I love the buff from the monkey. I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna say you gotta buff the rooster. No, you don't, because then the rooster would not spawn its second chick, which would be unfortunate for us. That would that would be deleterious. That's a strong team. We do lose this one, but I'm still feeling good. We're on seven. I like it. I like it. Chocolate. No chocolate. A monkey was like basically why I wanted chocolate. So I'm embracing this. I'm choosing to embrace it. 1417 melon armor, 1515 that spawns two 88 chicks. We lose. <laughs> um, that's just a strong team. I, dude, I, did you get something out of that eagle? That's a strong team. Holy cow. Okay, I have literally five minutes. We're going to run the fastest run of Super Auto Pets you've ever seen in your life. And then I am not going to... And I've never been late to this point, helpless hikers, to daycare. I always arrive like 10 minutes early and then just sit there singing uh, songs in my car until uh, the daycare provider actually exits the building. I'm never late. So you got to trust me on this one. But it does mean... We're going to be playing a little quickly, okay? But sometimes the faster I play, the better I do. Now, this team is very strong for it. We're, we're going to lose this one. This is just a very strong team for the early game. Sometimes you don't have the ability to, to pick your battles like that, you know? You know, I know I said you know about 20 times. I'm thinking... Maybe this is one of those rare opportunities where we get the chance to actually see what the dog doing, okay? I think it might have a shot here. The dog has been very uninspired. I also seem to not run into many dogs, and when I do, I uh, defeat them handily. But maybe this is uh, the exception that proves the rule. I don't know what that means, but smart people say it from time to time. We would like to maybe sell you, buy you. Combine you. Toss me a little buy-sell. Sell me. I do feel like the swan being worse now means that we're not going to be as good with the dog as we previously used to be, which is really bad because the dog has also just been bad for, like, a patch now. 
But, hold on. You're a piece. You piece. My God, a turtle's good. Drives me crazy. We should freeze you in case a turtle shows up later. Combine me. Buy me. Sell me. Buy me. Combine me. Chicken. I do love it. I do love it. Give me a chicken. Place me. Not enough gold. That makes perfect sense. That makes sense. We don't... I guess why not, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure, but what are we going to sell then? We're going to sell a mosquito and keep a cricket. So don't buy a mosquito. Well, I don't know, because we'd rather pop the melon armor, but a cricket kind of pops melon armor too. Well, now that we've not frozen one, that's probably the... That's probably the, the way to play it, but... Julius Salad. What a name, man. What a name. In the end, it probably doesn't matter. I would say sell me. Buy me. Combine me. Buy me. Combine me. God, me and what I wouldn't give for a freaking turtle right now. God, that would hit the spot. Sell me. Buy me. Freeze me. You're just a good buy sell. I'm going all in on the dog here. Like, I know right now it seems weird to sell a 5 6 for a 2 2, but it's a 2 2 that provides some upshot in theory. Hold on. I'm feeling very confident right now. Two rats. Okay. Thank you. We got to buff this rooster or we got to kill this rooster. There's only two options. Sell me. Freeze me. Buy me. Sell me. Turtle me. Rooster me. Combine me. Bit rare. Hit me with one of those, though. You don't, you don't see that. That's very important. You don't see that too much anymore. But the dog is at 1015. Is joining the 1015 club. Is that good enough? I don't know yet. I'm going to say probably not. But look at this. What are we at? We have five wins. Five wins. Can you believe it? Sell me, <laughs> buy me, combine me. You'd love to see that. Interesting. A shark could almost work here. I say no. Roll me, buy me, sell me, place me. 11 17. We, the same thing that happens every time we get the dog is happening here as well, which is that despite having the dog, we're not actually getting a level 2 dog, which means we lose. Okay, that's honestly, we needed to buff our rooster more. But this is something we've been asking for. Sell me, not pill me. Buy me. Buy me. Buy me. Sell me. Fly me. Buy me. In the future, buy me, because you're a good buy me, sell me. We got like a minute... But we got, we're close to death and we're close to being exalted as well. I, it, I mean, it's a minute to be 10 minutes early, if I'm being honest. I'm just like, believe, you wouldn't know it from the streams, but I'm actually like an early person. So like, leaving on time is stressful for me. Sell me, buy me. I'm still waiting for this turtle. I'll keep that pill frozen as long as I have to. Roll me, rooster me. Combine me. You know what? While we're here, why don't you just shark me? Why don't you shark me? I guess we should put it there. One day a turtle's gonna show up and you're all gonna you're all gonna be sorry. Fly v fly. I feel like my fly team is stronger. I don't feel like you have any recourse after this. I would love to level this fly though. It wouldn't bother me at all. Okay, what is leaving? The shark, probably, but not, not for these. Um, I guess level me. This is a great buy me, sell me opportunity here. I think we should do it. I think we should sell, buy, and then we'll consider selling the cricket if we get some tier ones, which we didn't. But hold the front frickin' door. There's something you're not going to see too much. But I'm, I'm a believer. I'm a believer in this. Huge, if true. Huge, huge. Huge, if true. I break you. I break you again. 
dude, I'm starting to believe that the speed runs are the way. Is that seven? That's eight wins. Something's wrong. There's something happening here, and what it is like ain't exactly clear. Whoops, that's my bed. <laughs> we created a zombie fly. Um, feed me. Feed me. Sell me. Still got eight gold. Don't sweat it. Tier ones, please. Tier ones. A tier one, thank you. We don't need another dog now. We don't need to wonder what the dog doing. We're very happy with this. Sell me. Don't sell me once more. Place me at the... Place me here. Roll me. We don't need the dog. We don't need the dog. Freeze me. Freeze me. Okay, we're gonna... Don't worry, we're gonna be on time, okay? It's with the, the maximum of four more rounds. There's probably light traffic today anyway. Owned. 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 I'm owned. I'm owned. I got owned. Okay, fair enough. I honestly thought we had you. That was a, a bit of an inventive team. I respect it. Sell me. Buy me. Sell me. Buy me. Sell me. Buy me. Sell me. Roll me. Buy me. Freeze me. Roll me. Freeze the fish, man. Act like you've been there before. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. That ox is very annoying. <laughs> Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Okay, we draw. The worst outcome for my temporal situation, but that's okay. Combine me. Level three rooster. We got to move you back a space. Freeze a dragon. We're going to think about it. I know we're on lethal, but we got to make some decisions here, okay? It's not as easy as I would like. Sell me. Roll me. We got a tier one. We place that tier one. We're not going to pill it. We will add melon armor to our rooster next turn. Roll me. If we live, we add melon armor to our rooster, okay? Melon breaker. Melon breaker. We win this. We're going to win this round. This rooster's going sicko mode, man. I think we can make it. Melon me. Sell me. Buy me. Forget this dragon. It's too late. We're going all in on this round for obvious reasons. Buy me. Sell me. Buy me. Feed me. Feed me. Hands off the keyboard. There's nothing more we can do. There's nothing more we can do. Level three turtle scares the crap out of me. But look, I have my own melon breakers. We're, we're gonna win this. We're gonna get 10. You always bet on a speed run. Everybody knows that. That's the power of the rooster. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.